With the Federal Tort Claims Act, or FTCA, Congress waived the United States' sovereign immunity to negligence claims. However, it left an exception for situations in which federal employees exercise their lawful discretion in making a decision. Ducer v. Visera provides an example of just such a discretionary exception, even when the federal employee's decision is arguably a bad one. On July 4, 1986, there was a fair at the Jefferson National Expansion Memorial in St. Louis, Missouri. The memorial is a national park within the jurisdiction of the National Park Rangers. A handbook written for the fair stated that law enforcement and holding cells would be scarce during the event. The handbook also stated that park rangers were to use their best judgment in making arrests and that the St. Louis Police Department was the lead agency for law enforcement. Larry Ducer was a fair attendee. He was intoxicated and physically harassing women. Two rangers, Visera and Bridges, warned Ducer to stop. But when Ducer urinated in public, they placed him under arrest. The rangers wanted to turn him over to the St. Louis police, but the police department was overwhelmed with the additional workload caused by the fair. The police were unable or unwilling to process Ducer, so the police and the rangers decided to release Ducer away from the fair so he wouldn't return and cause more trouble. Consequently, the rangers released Ducer in a parking lot somewhere in St. Louis, without money or transportation. Sometime after that, Ducer wandered onto the interstate and was killed by a motorist. Ducer's family sued under the FTCA. The district court dismissed for lack of subject matter jurisdiction. Ducer's family then appealed to the Eighth Circuit.